What's up guys, I'm going to bring you an update on uh, what's going on. Uh, tank's starting to get broken down. I have some people coming over to buy a whole bunch of corals tonight. Um, I finally got myself a little tank that I'm going to keep some of my favorite corals in. I'm going to be keeping a couple of the acros, my plates and scalimias, and then I'm going to frag a couple of the acros that were really hard for me to find to begin with. Uh, that way I just have a piece of them. So, uh, excuse my mess, I've been painting and packing and all kinds of stuff. What's up kid, there's a little reefer in the making. So this is what I picked up today. I picked up an innovative marine uh, 50 gallon all in one tank with stand. Um, beautiful tank. Uh, came with the pump, the filter socks, um, the tank with low iron glass. Um, this beautiful, beautiful stand um, with shelves and all that in there. Um, by no means are these tanks cheap. <laughs> like, I can't believe I think I, I paid as much for this tank as I did to build this tank and stand. But uh, it's manufactured for me. It's a beautiful tank and it's just done. I just needed something to be done. Um, I didn't have time to fuss around with building a stand, messing with a sump or anything like that. So I decided to go with an all-in-one. And uh, you guys know my boy CJ um, with his beautiful um, all-in-one tank. He's been doing them live streams on and uh, was really inspired by... Uh, how beautiful that tank is and I'm not going to be keeping a lot of corals um, it's going to be the brain and uh, some of my acros that I'm just going to throw in here I got a Radeon uh, Gen 3 still that I haven't done anything with since the fiasco that I had in the fish room so that's what I'm going to be using to light this um, I got an MP10 I'm going to put on this side and then I'm going to use a JBO uh, WP25 and then I got this uh, here at the back other than that, um, I'm going to throw some live rock in there. It's going to be bare bottom. I might leave it bare bottom. I'm not going to be doing a whole bunch of scaping. What up? <laughs> I'm not going to be doing a whole bunch of scaping or anything like that. I'm not going to put a lot of rock in here, just enough to keep the, uh, the uh, beneficial bacteria. And I am going to put my uh, high-end clowns in here that I have in the fish room. So that's what I'm going to be working on today, uh, filling this up with good tank water, putting the scalimias in here, the brain coral, and uh, getting those acros. Um, but yeah, I mean really nice. I mean this thing f sits on a foam gasket already from the factory Really really nice tank um, Expensive as hell, but you know, it should be worth it. Yeah, it's a Nuvo Aquarium Fusion Mini 50 50 gallon tank it measures 30 by 24 by 16 And it looks like oh, that's a serial number, but yeah, so this is uh, what we're gonna be rocking for now um, I might stay in this tank for a little bit. I got people coming over. I'm literally almost pretty much giving this stuff away. I put on the local forum to take this tank, all the corals, all the rock, all the filtration, the 120 gallon rimless in the fish room and everything in there for 2000 bucks. And uh, nobody wants to buy it all together. People want to piece it out. So I got people coming to look at acros tonight. I got people coming to look at frog spawn and hammer and we'll see what happens. Um, and then I'll probably just end up selling the tank in, in, in this stand for 400 bucks and selling the other one for 400 bucks. I just gotta get rid of it. So uh, that's what's going on guys. Uh, we're gonna get going on this uh, soon. I got some other things I need to take care of around the house first. I gotta, I gotta start working on the casita where the fish room is. I gotta get some stuff out of there and packed and then I gotta clean up the, uh, the back porch with my lawn equipment and stuff. And uh, then we'll be working on the tank later on tonight. So that's it y'all, we will, uh, Bring you updates when we, what up girl, when we uh, start loading this thing up and uh, we'll take a look at what it looks like. I'm still trying to figure out how I'm going to mount the light, but uh, I'm sure I can start, come up with some sort of creative way to mount the light. But uh, alright guys, we'll see you in a future update.